Welcome to part 11 of this tutorial series and in case you're wondering there wasn't supposed to be a part 11 but um, based on some of the questions that I've gotten I decided to create a part 11 to answer those questions well one question in particular and that is how do you flip the character from left to right after you have finished rigging it. Now, um, something that I didn't state in the la the final tutorial is that once you're finished rigging your character um, and stuff like that, you want to put all the, the master bone and the entire group within a group by itself, okay? So let's go ahead and do that now. So this is the group that contains the character and the master bone, we know that that con uh, controls the entire character. So put all of those parts within one group. So let me just select select those and put them in a group like so and what you want to do is just to move the the new group control points somewhere near the area where you had that master bone that master bone which is right here uh, you don't have to but when we're making the flip depending on where this is it will flip around at that point okay so you want to maybe get it as close to the center point of the character as possible so with this now grouped, in order to make that switch, well, let me actually turn off one of the, maybe the, the legs so you can know when it actually switches. So to make that flip, you would go to the, the final group layer and you would go into transformation and on scale, all you do is just to change the first value to a minus sign, which is the X value. So type minus, press enter twice and the character would flip. Now you can, of course you can animate that by just turning on animate, um, go to your transformation and just alter the value to get that keyframe. And then you can move forward and alter the value, add that minus sign again, press enter twice. So when you play it back, your character flips. Okay. And that's easy enough. So I hope that um, answers you know, any questions you may have had as it pertains to flipping the character after it's rigged. So yeah, once again, just to go over what I stated before, uh, once you've finished rigging your character, just place all the parts within one overall group, which is the, I guess you'd call this master group that contains your bones and everything else. Okay. And then you will just animate the flip on that particular group layer. So I hope you enjoyed this final, final tutorial in the series. And I will see you in the next one. Yo, Tim Hardy.